It has been nearly a week since 10-year-old Izzy Tishner's death. Today, Governor Spencer Cox announced he plans to meet with the Davis School District. The district has also committed to bringing in an independent investigator to look into how reported bullying was handled. Fox 13's Emily Tenser has the very latest tonight as anti-bullying advocates nationwide are demanding answers. The hashtag stand for Izzy is taking off across the country with actresses, NBA stars and leaders demanding change. But what does that change look like and what are those next steps parents and the district need to take? I think in the long run it, it's going to be kind of stand with Izzy is going to be something that, that everybody knows about. It's been almost one week since the world lost 10 year old Izzy Tishner to suicide. Local leaders and celebrities like Utah jazz player Joe Ingalls intend to make sure she isn't forgotten. It's a devastating thing um, and I think from her story we're going to make a lot of good things happen. Ingalls, the father of a son with autism, has spoken with Izzy's family and shown his support. Yeah, I think in the long run it, it's going to be kind of stand with Izzy is going to be something that, that everybody knows about. Jenny Dopp with the Utah Parent Center is also the parent of a son with autism. When you have a child yourself with a disability, you understand and it kind of hits closer to home that this could have easily been my child. The center offers resources to help families of kids with disabilities and health care needs. When it comes to bullying, Dopp says schools can help by focusing on specialized individual education plans so kids can learn self-advocacy. We can start to teach our our children to be self-advocates and learn how to recognize the signs of bullying. In a new statement from the Davis School District, it says the district is committed to preventing this from happening in the future. And that as part of the commitment, the district will be bringing in an independent investigation to look further into this and review handling of critical issues such as bullying. The Utah Parent Center has a number of resources available for parents regarding bullying. Parents can look at what to do if your child is being bullied, if your child is the bully. There's also information available for districts and special educators. Reporting outside Foxborough Elementary, Emily Tenser, Fox 13 News, Utah.